Hello guys, this is Mauro from Infotech.com and on this video we'll go through the steps to do a clean installation of Windows 10 with the full Creators update. If you're unfamiliar with this process, a clean installation simply means erasing everything on your device and installing a fresh copy of Windows 10. This will not only help you to avoid upgrade problems, but you will be starting with a new installation which can improve system performance and fix a number of previous issues. Because we're doing a clean installation, will be deleting everything on your computer, so it is always recommended to create a full backup before proceeding. For more details, check the video notes below to jump to the video with the steps to the full backup of your system. For this tutorial, I'll be using the uh, media creation tool to create a USB bootable media to install Windows 10 with the full Creos update. You can download the uh, media creation tool from the uh, Microsoft support website, and I'll be leaving also the link on the uh, video notes so you can go and download the uh, uh, the tool. Once you're on the uh, Microsoft Support website, simply click the, uh, the download tool now and save it. Once the uh, tool downloaded, just double click the uh, media creation tool.exe file. Click yes. Click the Asset button. Now select Create Installation Media for another PC and click Next. The Media Creation tool will automatically detect the uh, version of Windows you need, but if you're creating a little media to install Windows 10 on another PC, you can always uncheck this option and select the architecture, edition, and language of Windows 10 that you need. Because I'm going to be installing Windows 10 on this PC, I'm just going to keep this option checked and I'm going to click Next. In this section, select the USB flash drive option and make sure that you, you will be connecting a USB drive with at least uh, four gigabytes of, of space and make sure to make a backup of any data that is important to you that is stored on that drive because it will be erased uh, through this process. Click Next. If you haven't connected the USB drive that you want to use, connect it now and click the uh, Refresh Drive list and select the drive. Click Next. Now the Media Creation Tool will proceed to download the, uh, the files and create the uh, bootable media so you can install Windows 10 with the full career update on your computer. After the USB flash drive is ready, click Finished and keep the uh, drive connected and reboot your computer. Also make sure that your device can boot from USB. Usually to boot from a USB drive you'll need to change the uh, BIOS settings which is pretty much different on every device. So make sure to check your PC manufacturer support website for more details. However, typically you can access these settings by pressing one of the uh, functions key, the delete key or escape key during boot. After restarting your computer with the boot of media and the uh, Windows setup wizard, click Next. Click Install Now. If Windows 10 was already installed and properly activated, you don't need to enter a product key on this section. After the installation, Windows 10 will automatically activate without further steps. Because I'm doing a clean installation of Windows 10 on a device that had already Windows 10, I'm going to click the uh, I don't have a product key link. And here I'm just going to select the version of Windows 10 for my computer. And click Next. Check this option to agree to the terms and click Next. Select the custom option 
to do a clean install of Windows 10 with the Fall Creators Update. Select the drive that you want to use to install Windows 10. If you have multiple partitions, you can select each one and click the uh, delete button. Click OK. Click delete and click OK. Deleting all the partitions allows Windows 10 to use the entire drive to create a single partition to install the new version. Simply select the uh, an allocated space and click next to begin the installation of Windows 10 with the default creator update. After the installation completes, uh, the computer will reboot and we're going to go through the uh, out of box experience to finish setting up the installation of Windows 10 with the default creator update. Hi there, I'm Cortana, and I'm here to help. A little sign in here, a touch of Wi-Fi there, and we'll have your PC ready for all you plan to do. You can use your voice or the keyboard along the way, and if you'd like me to stay quiet, you can just mute your PC. If you need an assistive screen reader, press the Windows, Control, and Enter keys at the same time to enable narrator. Okay, enough intro. Let's dig in. Your region is set to the United States. Is that right? Now we are in the out of box experience to finish setting up the uh, installation. On this section, select your region and click Yes. Select the uh, keyboard layout, in this case, US, and click Yes. If you want to add a second keyboard layout, you can click the Add Layout button. But for now, I'm just going to click the uh, Skip button. Select the uh, Setup for Personal Use option and click Next. Here, we're going to create a new account for Windows 10 using a Microsoft account. Type your email address, phone number, or Skype ID. If you're looking to create a local account, you'll need to click the uh, offline account and follow those steps. Click Next. Type your email password and click Next. You can set up a PIN password, but in this case, that is something that you can do later. So I'm going to click the uh, do this later. If you want, Windows 10 now also offers an option to link your phone to your PC, but that's something that you can also do later through the uh, settings app. So I'm just going to click the uh, do this later. Here you can decide whether or not to use uh, Cortana and just choose no or yes. In my case, I'm just going to click yes. On this section, you can choose your privacy settings for your device. As you can see, all the um, settings are enabled by default, but you can, you can always turn off the uh, toggle switch for the uh, privacy settings that you don't want. And as you turn them off, you can also read how your experience is going to be affected if you don't, if you disable that particular privacy setting. Once you made your privacy setting choices, click the accept button. Voice mode on. Almost done now. We just need to get a few more things polished up for you and Windows will be all yours. Looking forward to helping out.
now that we're back on the desktop the last thing left to do is to make sure that you have the latest updates so make sure to open the uh, settings app and go to update and security and check for updates also make sure to reinstall all your apps and restore your files from backup and that's how you do a clean installation of Windows 10 with the full curious update please make sure to check the video notes for more information such as the release date for this version of Windows 10 and more remember to like the video share it leave your comments subscribe if you haven't done that yet and I just hope this video was informative for you and I'd like to thank you for viewing